Welcome once again to Commander by Danon. Today's video was brought to us by Patreon supporter Borgi. Huge thanks to Borgi and the rest of my Patreon supporters. Borgi reached out asking for a deck led by Asika, God of the Tree, but he wasn't certain what theme he wanted to go with. If you're enjoying my content, please like and subscribe. I really appreciate the support, and if you like the deck list, consider sharing this video as well. Isika God of the Tree is a 3-mana 1-4 legendary god with vigilance. We may tap her to add 1 mana of any color. Additionally, other legendary creatures we control have vigilance and may tap to add 1 mana of any color. The flip side of Isika is the Prismatic Bridge, a 5-color, five 5-mana five legendary enchantment. At the beginning of our upkeep, we reveal cards from the top of our library until we reveal a creature or planeswalker card. We then put that card onto the battlefield, and the rest on the bottom of our library in a random order. Some people build a Sika as a Super Friends deck with lots of Planeswalkers. Others build her as a God deck. My issue with God decks is that Gods don't play well with each other, especially when they're from different Mythos. But even when they're from the same Mythos, there exists some tension. For example, Perforos can never help Erebos become a creature and vice versa. Captain and Hazaret are opposites. One requires you to have a full hand, the other requires your hand to be mostly empty. So instead, I suggested we just go with big boy cards. Lots of big, smashy creatures that your opponents are going to get tired of real quick. Borgie loved the idea. But before we get to our deck list, a quick word from our sponsor, Ultimate Guard. One of my favorite products Ultimate Guard has is their Xenoskin Sidewinder. The Sidewinder has a soft microfiber lining as well as the rugged Xenoskin shell we've all come to love. While the Sidewinder isn't a new product, they are now available in the beautiful two-tone synergy series, like this blue-red one seen here. Find out if your local game store carries Ultimate Guard products, or click on the link down below to order yourself one from Amazon. In order to build a functional commander deck, you need lots of different pieces, which is why I try to rely on my handy-dandy checklist. 50 mana sources, usually split between 37 lands and 13 pieces of ramp, 10 pieces of card advantage, 8 to 10 pieces of spot removal, 2 to 3 board wipes, 2 pieces of graveyard hate, and 1 sudden I win card. One last announcement before we get to our video. I've started streaming on Twitch. I've been playing mostly Final Fantasy XIV for the first hour or so, then switching over and making commander decks for future videos. If you'd like to see what I'm working on, check out twitch.tv slash Wildfire. Command Tower, Exotic Orchard, Flooded Strand, Arid Mesa, Polluted Delta, Verdant Catacombs, Wooded Foothills, Scalding Tarn, Marsh Flats, Bloodstained Mire, Windswept Heath, Misty Rainforest, Rafine's Tower, Xander's Lounge, Zia Tora's Proving Ground, Jetmere's Garden, Spara's Headquarters, Hallowed Fountain, Sacred Foundry, Watery Grave, Overgrown Tomb, Stomping Ground, Steam Vents, Godless Shrine, Blood Crypt, Temple Garden, Breeding Pool, One Plains, Two Island, Two Swamps, Two Mountains, and Three Forests make up the land base for this deck. Soul Ring, Arcane Signet, Chromatic Lantern, Thrawn Dynamo, Three Visits, Nature's Lore, Far Seek, Sky Shroud Claim, Regal Behemoth, Crucible of Worlds, Conduit of Worlds, Burgeoning, Exploration, and Smothering Tithe help us to ramp out and stay ahead of the curve. Sun Titan, Consecrated Sphinx, Nezahal Primal Tide, Villas Broker of Blood, Soul of the Harvest, Runescarred Demon, AC Tyrant of the Gyre Strait, Burning Rune Demon, 
Ristic Study, Teamer Ascendancy, Jace the Mind Sculptor, and Scroll Rack help us to keep our hands full and find answers. Hullbreaker Horror, Meteor Golem, Terastodon, Noxious Gear Hulk, Apex Althasar, Angel of the Ruins, Assassin's Trophy, Abraid, Fracture, Negate, Dovin's Veto, Ashiok Dream Render, and Narset Parter of Veils help us to keep our opponents in line. Massacre Worm, Cyclonic Rift, and Farewell help us to reset the board as needed. Itali Primal Storm, Elish Norn Grand Cenobite, Shieldred Whispering One, Galta Primal Hunger, Niv Mizzet Perun, Avacyn Angel of Hope, Itali Primal Conqueror, Agent of Treachery, Grave Titan, Archon of Cruelty, Cultivator Colossus, Sarah's Emissary, Diluvian Primordial, Brainstealer Dragon, and Urabrask the Hidden make up the core of our deck, and how we plan on winning. Supporting our plan, we've got Panharmonicon, Elish Norn Mother of Machines, Yarok the Desecrated, Sphinx of the Second Sun, and Paradox Haze. Now that we have our deck list, let's compare it to our checklist. 51 mana sources split between 37 lands and 14 pieces of ramp. 12 pieces of card advantage. 13 pieces of interaction. 3 board wipes. 2 pieces of graveyard hate in Farewell and Ashiar Dream Render. No sudden I win cards, but lots of value. Not only do we have lots of ways to bring our creatures back, we can put creatures from our hand back on top of our library so that Prismatic Bridge can find them. Oh, look at that. Surprise, surprise. We do have a few tutors in our deck, but we probably want to use them to find interaction or board wipes rather than creatures. After all, the Prismatic Bridge can cast our creatures for us. The exception to that would be something like Paradox Haze or Sphinx of the Second Sun. After all, having two or three upkeeps every turn means we can put two or three creatures on the battlefield. Do you have an Asika God of the Tree deck? Did you go with a specific theme? What's your secret deck tech? Leave a comment below. Thanks for tuning in. Once again, a huge shout out to my daughter Cute Stuff. I couldn't make these videos without her. If you'd like to hire her to edit your own videos, she can be reached at cutestuff.edits at gmail.com. Link is down below. If you're looking for ways to support the channel directly, you can head on over to patreon.com slash For only $25, you too can have a commander video built at your request. I also wanted to give a quick shout out to all of my patrons. Waffles, Jiraiya, Danny, Muffins, Marcus, Squishy, Brett, Roxy, Sean, Pob Zombie, Mark, Borgi, Naswin, Pedro, Tom, Cole, Midge, Detroff, Rally, Frank, Alex, Jenny, Alex, Julio, Michael, Valeri, Callow, and Aprico. You guys are awesome. I post new Commander Deck videos every weekday, so be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified of new videos. Again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all again next time on Commander by Daniel.